Hello and welcome to the Easter update of what's going on in Hampshire, Surrey and Berkshire. So we're doing it a bit different this this, this term. Um, I'm going to have got uh, various different people coming in to tell us what they are doing over Easter. So I'm going to start off with a lovely Dale from Casa Club. So, Ca so Casa Club is a holiday scheme and you've got them all over. So which, which venues yeah. have you got them in? Uh, so we are, we've got um, the, Cam the Cambridge School in Aldershot, Fernhill Academy in Farnborough, um, South Camberley Juniors in Camberley, Lakeside Primary in Frimley, St Polycarps in Farnham and <laughs> at St James's School in Weybridge. Well done. And you don't need to be a member of those schools to go. No, you so don't. So I've sent my children to all of them, actually. Oh, I've, I've oh, tried amazing. all of them. I've tried amazing. them all. Um, so what kind of activities are you doing over Easter? Uh, we are, we've got so much planned. Um, we're going to be doing all sorts of arts and crafts, baking, sports, group games, um, yeah, there's just a lot going on. Uh, we've got family fun days at uh, both our Hampshire clubs, so um, because we do the holiday activity and food scheme. Um, so that's in your, on free school meals, is that It's you free can? school meals, yeah. Benefit related free school meals and vulnerable families. You get um, six hours of childcare, um, and with that, we provide a hot meal and a pudding. We have smoothie bars. Um, we're planning a really fun uh, family fun day. So all families, whether you're half or not, can come in. We've got a barbecue. Uh, we're going to have bouncy castles. What day was this? Um, so, uh, <laughs> yeah. um, so it's, Hampshire is from the 11th, I believe. So Aldershot is going to be the 12th for the family fun day. And Farm Bra is the 13th for the family awesome. fun day. Sounds great fun. And what are your prices? Um, OK, so uh, we have two different sessions for our standard day, which is 10 till 4. Um, it's £27. Uh, for our uh, um, extended day, which is 8 till 6. It's thirty pounds. So, and, and do you do like any um, vouchers or anything? Um, I believe we've got a voucher out at the moment with a discount. Uh, we also offer discount to emergency services. Yep. Um, so that's ten percent. And do you off. accept any childcare vouchers? We, or... Yeah, we accept all the childcare vouchers, tax-free childcare, um, the childcare grant scheme. Um, yeah, so we've got quite a lot, quite of a lot of going on. Options, yeah. Oh, yeah. amazing! So those are really handy. There's not, they're really good cubs because they're kind of you take them from quite a young age. It's kind you of four. four. Then and quite a lot of the holiday camps is yeah. kind of seven plus. So to get one from four is quite good. Absolutely, um, and we cater all of our activities in age groups, so like key stage one and key stage two, um, and we adapt all of the activities that are, you know so they're appropriate for the age group that are and coming. And what, what do you go up to? Is it twelve? Uh, twelve. Although we have got a couple that are thirteen. Yeah. Um, which is fine. Well, especially you know. if you've got siblings and stuff. Siblings quite and hand. things, yeah, absolutely, yeah, yeah. So. Oh, amazing. Well, thank you very much oh, for joining us. You. So this is Casa Club. It's, it's on the um, localfamily.events um, search engine. If you just click on the holiday camps, they will all come up. So um, in case you didn't know, there's Surrey, Hampshire and Berkshire do not have the same Easter holidays. No. So, <laughs> so um, Surrey, they break up on the 4th whereas Hampshire break up on the 11th, and they're yeah. both for two weeks. So there is an overlap week, which is there's quite a lot going on that week. Absolutely. Um, but yeah, there is a week either side. So check that if you're in a particular area that it's running on your your um, particular week. Yeah, absolutely. And, and we're in the office from 9.30 till 2.30. So, you know, if, if anyone's got any inquiries, you know, they can give us a call you, or... And you do respond from on Facebook quite quickly. We try it? to, yeah. We, yeah, I'm always available on Facebook um, <laughs> pretty much 24-7. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you know, um, as much as you'd like to say when you leave work you leave work behind no. you never do in this industry you know <laughs> no. it's just a constant thing really so brilliant well thank you very much well, for joining thank us you. thank you thank you so much so while we're on the craft i'm just going to quickly chat through a few of the other crafty bits that we've got going so i'm um, bubbling squeak kitchen they are running two sessions one for the surrey um, and one for the hampshire so on the 12th and 14th they're in fleet these are uh, I think it's two hour sessions, one and a half hour sessions, where you do cook two different things and it's £17 from the age of um, five to about 11. Um, and in the past, they've normally do things like baking bread and then do some cakes or something, you know, it's quite nice. And then on the second week, they're doing them in Farnborough um, and this is on the 20th to the 22nd, again, £17, same ages. There is also the Forest Approach. These are in Hartley Whitney um, and they've got various dates all over the um, the Hampshire, so from the 11th onwards. Um, and these guys, they do bushcraft and um, like toasting marshmallows. They do loads of outdoor crafts. Um, and this is around the campfire. Um, and that's with the forest approach. Um, they've got different sessions at different times. So you're going to have to go and have a look to see what kind of, I know that they book up quite quickly because they're, they're following. Wonderwood Forest School in, um, in Farnham. 
and they've just opened a brand new one in Fleet. So in final, it's on the 11th, um, and it's 10 till 2, and it's £30 for a drop-off. And this, again, this is Forest School. So we, when we reviewed it, they, they like it's, it was all bushcraft. They've got the hammocks out. You can just go and chill in the hammocks. They've got the fire. They've got muddy play, that kind of thing. And then they're running another one in Fleet on the 12th. Um, and, but this is a family session from 10 till 12 and it's for children 2 to 10 years old so you go with your child for this one and that one is £12 um, there is also the village in Surrey so these guys run at Bisley Yurt um, and it's around the fire she hasn't decided exactly what her activities were but she said it will be very similar to her February ones and in February she did like candle making and tie dyeing you know kind of very kind of mm. mother earthy kind of things they do some lovely sessions there um, and yes, yeah, so that's all the arts and craft ones that I know are going on. But we'll move on to the next style of holiday camp in a minute. And so we are here with the lovely Yulia from Popolo. I can't say it. You say Popolo it. Popolo Saranico. <laughs> and she runs a beautiful uh, pottery painting business. You've been running for a couple of years now, haven't yes, you? Yes, exactly. Come, like and it's come on really years. quickly, hasn't it? Yes. It has come on really quickly. <laughs> and so she, obviously sometimes you run in different venues. Are you running any venues in the next couple of weeks? Uh, yes, I do. I'm on Monday in Tongam Toddlers doing Easter pottery painting and prints, and then the following Monday in Shalford and Guildford. Um, and then 30th of March, I'm in Hindhead. So all over the place. But you <laughs> the can just send, if they go to the local family events, they can find the particular dates. Yes, so you do, exactly. you do baby feet painting, like, you know, with the little feet and the hands and yes. stuff, don't you? And then you also do kits. Do you want to show us the box? So these yes. are the boxes that you get delivered. Can you see that on screen? And so the lovely Yulia turns up with all the bits that you've ordered in the box, with all the paints and the brushes and everything you need, don't you? Yes. Um, and then um, you can go and paint whatever you like. So I've done these a few times. I have my niece and nephew come yes. over, <laughs> yeah, um, and it's quite <laughs> nice. It's quite nice to have as a um, an indoor rainy day activity as a backup it's quite a nice one isn't it yes. especially you've got people coming over and for birthday parties as well because you can get it all done nicely and it's yes. automatically the take home present isn't it because yes. Yulia takes them away glazes them so they look really professional and then you can either drop them off or pick you can go and pick them up from Yulia yes. and then you've got these amazing things so we did something like this I remember yes, at Christmas all of the grandchildren use their fingerprints to make a lovely design and that yes. was the grandparent gift but obviously over Easter so what have you got for Easter? Right, so for Easter I've got lovely Easter bunnies <laughs> <laughs> and egg cups. So we all add just eight pounds each, and for that eight pounds you get. And for eight pounds, it's, it's quite good because obviously you're dropping it. You, you you got the whole dropping off, and then got to go and glaze it. So it's your yes. time to go and glaze it, and then organise a collection and, and everything. Also personalisation is included. Oh yeah, because you write the yes. names on the bottom. So yeah, you get loads of stuff really. It's really nice, yes. especially if there's somebody that's isolating as well. You have a kit dropped off, can't yes. you, for them so that they can and go and do it, something. It can also be a nice surprise. So for example, once I had a godmother, who lives quite far away. So she ordered a box for her goddaughter <laughs> and she asked me to sign uh, like a happy birthday, dear Alice, I can't remember the name of the girl. And then she said, God, your godmother. Oh, that's lovely. Godmother fairy probably. So I, I, up to now, I remember the face of the little girl who received it. She couldn't believe it. Oh, <laughs> like, that's so lovely. That is lovely. Yes, Are you doing priceless. something for Mother's Day as well, aren't you? Yes, I do. So for Mother's Day, um, you can order some lovely jugs or vases, mugs, uh, makeup, brush, pots, and um, yes, you can, some moms order them and capture prints themselves or just yeah. paint it with so the children. So either drop some big hints that you'd like some, yes. or if you're the dad and you're looking for ideas, this might be a nice one. It's actually quite thoughtful as well, isn't yes. it? Well, thank you very much for joining us. So you're running stuff over Easter, you're doing the Easter boxes, but you don't have to just do Easter boxes boxes you could you could have whatever Anything. you wanted in, in yes. there you could even get stuff ready for halloween or christmas if you really yes, wanted to exactly. you could <laughs> get them in early um, and then yeah yuli will organize everything else you cover is it all the shot camberley frimley Gilford, farnborough guildford yeah all those kind yes. of areas so yeah just pop on to local family events and you'll find all the information about the lovely yulia and what she's doing <laughs> over the next few months